obviously for a first home buyer to sit on their heels and wait the 32 days until their files picked up or whatever, it must be just burning. That money will be burning a hole in their pocket after they've saved it for so long and they're watching prices go up. But I guess what you're saying is that just bide your time, get, get your broker evolved as early as possible and get yourself underway, you know, all that paperwork underway as early as possible. And then don't get itchy feet. Don't get out there and buy something before you're ready. Yeah, you've got to be you've got to be well advanced. You've got to prepare months in advance, I would say. Um, because it's sometimes it's things that you won't even know or you won't think has an impact. You people won't sit back and go, Well, I've got a deposit, I've got a job, that's enough. Mm. Um, but you know, going and having a look at your sort of savings pattern or or expenditure pattern, and people might be thinking, Well, okay, I'm spending a little bit more, but once I've got my property, I know I won't be able to do that. So I'm <laughs> going by now because the we're not doesn't ball. necessarily understand that, do they? Well, they, no. well, they can't actually take that as some sort of given because they've got to go with data and facts. Yeah, exactly right. And then if you're borrowing more than 80% of the, the property's value. Um, it might there might be other checks that need to be uh, taken into account with, because you, you need mortgage insurance, and it won't. Mm. A lot of the banks now approve on behalf of the mortgage insurer. It used to be a long time ago that they would go through two approval processes, but um, a, a lot of banks now do that themselves. But still, they're going to look at it even closer if they're lending more than eighty percent of the value. So, getting all that work done at the at the front end is not only important so that you don't go and buy a property and then realise you can't get a loan. Um, but, but also making sure that we now know that there's a lot of lead time involved, a lot of waiting time, um, that if we do that well in advance, at least then when we're actually ready to go, we are actually ready to go. Mm. 